You've probably heard that the DJI Osmo Pocket 3 is the best vlogging camera in 2024. You've also heard that it's compact, easy to use, and practically invisible in vlogging in public. <laughs> but none of this matters because you still hesitate to pick one up. I'm guessing that's because you don't have enough relatable examples to justify buying one. I think I can help with that. I'll show you three different scenarios that I filmed to get the most out of the Osmo Pocket 3. Oh, and heads up, I will be using OP3 and Osmo Pocket 3 throughout this video. Just know that I'm talking about the same camera. I just like referring to it in both ways. All right, let's get started. First up is cooking. Now, by no means is my channel a cooking channel, but since I prepare the majority of my meals, I figured it'd be a good idea to use the Osmo Pocket 3 to film my process. All right, so next up is my outside drills. Um, this is actually my preferred way of working out, but I haven't been out here in a while, so I'm just kind of trying to ease back into things here. And uh, yeah, we're gonna see what kind of footage we could get from the OP3, the Osmo Pocket 3. Let's get it.
man, I forgot how good it is to come out here and stretch out my legs a bit. I gotta get back out here more, man. I gotta, I gotta come back out here. Whew. Hopefully you guys enjoyed all the footage that I shot on the OP3. Everything I did out here was shot on the OP3. Um, and I only used the OP3's battery. I didn't use the extended battery that comes with the Creator Combo. So, and I was out here for about two hours. So that lets you know how long that battery lasts. Catch you guys in the next scenario. Deuces. All right, so I forgot to mention this in a video, but let me know if you want to see a breakdown of how I got these shots on the OP3. I could probably make another video about it. So let me know in the comment sections below. All right, back to the video. All right, so I've showed you the cooking scenario, the outdoors workout scenario, and I bet you're thinking that the car video was my third scenario. And you'd be wrong, kind of. You can count that one as a bonus, but the one that I had in mind was this, these talking head videos. You see, up until this point, 90% of this video was shot on the OP3. I've shot close-ups, tracking, and slow motion shots all in a normal color profile on this camera, and all for various niches. The footage is clear and stable, so there's no need to buy a gimbal to stabilize it. It's already built in. The mic is good, and the battery lasts a lot longer than I expected it to. And that's without using the extended battery that comes with the Creator Combo. Hopefully by now you can see how versatile this camera is, and how easy it is to use especially if you want to start a YouTube channel or you just want to get better quality content for your other social media platforms. It's the one-stop shop for any new creator out there. With that being said, I only have one question for you. You down with OP3? I'll link it down in the description below in case you want to pick one up. You made it this far, so I know you don't hate this video. So go ahead and subscribe for more content and on your way out, hit that like button. And if you're new here, welcome to the Tech Tribe, where the vibes are good and the content is better. And as always, thank you for watching. I'll catch you in the next one. Deuces.